its happiness. We can come together around an animal that we all love. We were able to unite around the camel. It's a very simple idea at first. I didn't think it would have this impact on the world. This is the story of each of us. We don't know why we love camels, but I believe it is in our DNA. It's a special relationship and it is in the DNA of each of us. The breeders I know, when we sit down at the table and ask them the same question, we don't know how to answer it. I proposed the parade and asked for authorization from the French authorities in August 2023. It was difficult and I got no answers. I had the right to make the parade, but for the route, they could give me no answer. I insisted to find out if they agreed with my proposed route. January 2024, they did not agree with the route I wanted. They offered me another route. In writing, I asked to meet them. It took three months before they responded to me, and finally I had a meeting with them. We agreed on the new route they proposed to me at the foot of the Eiffel Tower. From the moment I had the word of the state that the parade could follow this route, I made the whole project official, and thus when 34 countries around the world said they wanted to come. The USA said no matter the route, we will be there. From this point, we study the security, logistics, and protection because I do not want to take animals into the streets or in front of the crowd without having all the security for the animals and for the public. At this time, we undertook serious organization. It was March 6, and the parade was to take place on April 20. On April 10, they called to tell me it would be best not to do it. But for us, cancelling was impossible. We had committed so many things. The delegations had taken their plane tickets, their hotel. The whole organization was set. So I said there is no question of postponing or doing something different. And two days before the parade, I was told, we prohibit the parade unless you do it elsewhere. I have been mayor for 35 years. It is an answer to democracy and the state because the state gave their word and must respect it. Now we make practice for the Kamil for tomorrow in Paris. As a training for tomorrow. We are training for the big parade of Camel. Practicing for the parade tomorrow. We are practicing for the parade in Paris tomorrow. We just went for a stroll through the streets of Jean Brie. I think today there are more chameaux in Jean Brie than habitants. He was surprised because so many camels, he said there is more camels than inhabitants in the Jambri village. <laughs> I am very touched by all the people who trusted me. When you come from the USA, India and elsewhere and you are trusted, I did not want to betray it.
the very beautiful. Uh, I'm surprised to see them uh, today. Uh, beautiful camel from different countries, so it's quite unique. The first camel carried the peace flag. There are 34 countries that participated. Shiites, Sunnis, Catholics, Protestants, Hindus. And during all this time spent together, these people ate together, talked together as if they had known each other and they had never met. This parade is proof that we can live in tolerance, in fraternity, in humanity, around an idea. If it's the camel, so much the better. This camel is a symbol so strong for me. Today, we did a parade, perhaps not in the best place, but with so much happiness, energy and success that I am very, very happy.